Hello and welcome to Lloyd BMW South Lakes. Today we have this stunning BMW 420D M Sport convertible. It's a 21 plate uh, car, it's done just over 9,000 miles. Finished in this gorgeous uh, sapphire black metallic paint and it's set on these 19 inch diamond cut alloy wheels uh, with the M Sport brakes. So you get the blue brake calipers, which I think look very, very nice. Uh, inside the car, we have black Vanaska leather, which has a blue contrast stitching. Being an M Sport, you get the sport seats, you get the bigger side bolsters and the adjustable under thigh support as well. This car's also part of the M Sport Pro Pack. You've got the uh, M colours on the seat belt, which I think is uh, very nice. Jump inside. So on the new four series, you've got the digital dash. And you can see the mileage there, 9,006 miles. Uh, I'll start it up by pressing the button here. As long as you've got the key on you and your foot's on the brake, the car will start. A little bit chilly today, so fortunately this car's got uh, heated seats. It's also got a heated steering wheel. And for absolute luxury, it's also got a neck scarf. So uh, this is uh, built into the headrest here and it blows warm air on the back of your neck. So uh, if you want to drive the uh, with the roof down in uh, winter, uh, with the heated seats, the air conditioning, the heated steering wheel, the air scarf, you'll uh, remain uh, toasty and warm. So a big satellite navigation screen up there. Uh, if you select reverse, you've got parking sensors front and rear. You've got a rear camera as, as well. You've got DAB radio. You've got uh, Bluetooth for your phone as well. So you've got your dual zone climate controls down here. You've got your favorite buttons. Uh, you've got this very nice kind of uh, aluminum trim, which runs through the, uh, the dashboard into the center console as well. Uh, underneath here, you've got a wireless charging pad. You've got a USB port for your uh, phone. Uh, if you haven't got wireless charging, you've got your uh, drinks holders, uh, 12 volt supply in there, automatic gearbox, very, very good gearbox. Um, leave it alone and sort itself out. Or if you're in the mood, you've got the paddles on the steering here and here. Uh, so you can take control of the gears manually. You've got your parking sensor button, traction control buttons down here, on off. Different driving modes, uh, obviously adaptive is uh, quite cool. It'll just sort itself out. Electric can brake, but it's also got auto hold, which is quite handy in traffic. So uh, most automatics, of course, when you take your foot off the brake, the car starts to creep. If you've got the auto hold on, it will stop it from doing that. Fully electric uh, hood. So uh, uh, I'll show you that now, actually. Um, to put the roof up and down, very, very quick operation. And you don't even have to stop the car. Obviously, you've got to reduce the speed. Uh, but uh, no, it's very, very quick and easy. So I shall demonstrate that now. And there you have it so i didn't time it but uh, very very quick to uh, to put the uh, to put the roof up on the steering wheel you've got your uh, cruise control speed limit uh, you've also got um, you can answer your phone voice activation uh, and your media controls over here and as i mentioned you've also got a heated steering wheel uh, you've got automatic wipers you've also got automatic headlights and I said you've got that excellent Harman Kardon sound system as well. You may also notice the purple lights, um, part of the ambient lighting, you can change the colour of these, so you can have green, you can have uh, blue, uh, orange, white, or obviously purple as it's set. This car's got the electric seats, which has got a couple of memories, so handy for a couple of drivers. Electric windows all round, and also you've got your folding mirrors as well, so quick press of the button, there you go. Quick glimpse of me, sorry. <laughs> um, and so if you're in a tight space or anything like that, it's handy just sometimes to fold the uh, the mirrors in. The other thing the 4 Series convertible has is this uh, seat butler. So you can see it presents the seat belt to you. So, so rather than having to reach all the way back there and try and grab it and strain yourself, it's got this sort of seat belt butler which hands you the seat belt. So uh, very, very cool. Right, I'll just turn the, uh, the engine off and I'll show you the rest of the car. So you can see that. Seatbelt Butler is now uh, retracted into place. Um, car's a four-seater, so you've got uh, two seats in the back, 
storage and drinks holders in the middle. ISO fix on both of the outer seats as well. So you can put two kiddie seats in there. Come around this side, you can now see what the car looks like with the, uh, the roof up, very, very stylish. Uh, lights flash there because it's got uh, like an auto key. So as I walk away, it will automatically lock. And as I walk towards the car, it will automatically unlock as well, which is quite a nice feature if you ever forget to lock your car. Uh, 420D badging on there. You've got the little diffuser underneath, the twin exhaust, and then uh, if we open up the boot, you can see you've got a reasonable amount of boot space. If you just push that there, come back a little bit. It's a pretty big boot space uh, for a convertible. Uh, and then also if you want to put the roof down, you just pull that flap down there, and you've still got reasonable space underneath. One of the advantages of the new 4 Series, having the fabric roof, when you fold the roof down, you still do get reasonable amount of, uh, of boot space in there as well so this car is currently for sale here at lloyd bmw south lakes if it's of any interest then give us a shout we can arrange a test drive or uh, finance figures or anything like that in the meantime hope you enjoyed the video bye for now